Hey there, my name is Dylan Schmidt and I'm a senior RMM admin at Provel Tech. Today I want to go over how to review your scheduled scripts within ConnectWise Automate. Please click the like and subscribe button in the bottom right corner so you never have to miss out on another video. Let's get into it. First, to get to your scheduled scripts section in Automate, you can go to Automation, Scripts, and Scheduled Scripts. Here, you get a window that shows you all scripts you have scheduled against any groups, clients, agents, or against the maintenance group. From here, you have a few ways to sort through this information. You can sort by script name, you can sort by the target group, so either the group, client, or agent, as well as how often it is being run. So this is very nice to double check for any scripts that might be running on a 15, 10, five minute interval. From here, you have a few options for what you can do with these scripts. You can select any script, right click, and delete or disable this script schedule. So if you disable one, it will gray it out so that the schedule is still here, but is not going to run anymore. This is good if you want to temporarily turn a script off, prevent it from running, and then be able to come back to it later and enable. When you re-enable it, it is now no longer grayed out. For anything you know you'd like to get rid of, that is where you can right click and delete script schedule and it will remove it entirely from the screen. Another thing you can look at, and we can find a good example um, let's use this Chrome installer. So another option you have is the showed scheduled script history. This will open up a separate window, which will show you where this script has run, when, and against what agent. So here we can see that this script has run once a day against all agents within the software deployment Chrome not installed group. So that this kind of gives us validation that all the agents in that group are indeed having the script run against them. One other option we have here is the ability to edit the script schedule. And you can get to that either by right click and edit script schedule, or you can double click on the entire row as well. This will give you a quick prompt that will show you which group the script is being applied from so that you can open that group and edit the script from there. So in this case, this is being controlled by the Google Chrome group. So I'll click yes to open that group. From here, we can go to computers and scheduled scripts to see this script here. So again, this will validate we are running this once a day at 10 a.m. and it is running against all agents. If we wanted to edit this schedule, we would make sure we have it selected down here and we would be able to change either the frequency or the time it is running during the day. So maybe instead of 10 a.m., I wanted this to run at uh, noon and then have it run once a week instead of every day. So I can have it run every Monday at noon. And then you'd click update to have that update there. One thing to consider when going through the scheduled scripts for review is how frequently scripts are running. It is very good to check once a month, once a quarter to make sure that there are no scripts scheduled to run very frequently or against a very large number of agents very frequently. So that's where we can use this schedule filter to look at which scripts are running kind of on a 15 to 30 minute frequency. And here we can see these all look to be default scripts included with automate that are running against the maintenance group. The maintenance group is basically client scripts that for every 15 minutes is only running the script once. Something we might want to look at is if there are any scripts 
running on a 15 minute interval that were scheduled against the all agents group. So in this case, there's only 10 agents in this environment, but if you had 1,000, 10,000 agents within Automate and you were running a script against every single one of them every 15 minutes, that could potentially cause some slowness within your Automate environment. So always nice to check every once in a while to review that there aren't scripts scheduled to run against all agents very frequently. Thanks for watching. We post a new video every week to share our knowledge on ConnectWise Automate. Let us know what else you would like to see, or if you have any questions, please leave your response in the comments section below, and don't forget to subscribe.